Getting to know you. With Damiana Garcia. This is Getting to Know You. I'm Damiana Garcia. Tonight's guest, Rick Previn, is a high school teacher and a homosexual, offering a bridge of friendship between homos and straights through his school's Gay Straight Alliance Club. Hello. I'm Rick Previn. I'm the faculty president of my school's Gay Straight Alliance Club. I'm a ninth grade biology teacher. Tell me about the kids in your club. I love my kids. I've got the greatest kids in the world. They're just so full of life. They're such colorful personalities, each one of them. We're a really tightly knit club. I'm hoping next semester maybe to recruit some gay kids to be in the club. But we've got a lot of great girls, a lot of really sweet straight girls who are so supportive of the gay community. No guys? And a few straight guys. They bring their guy friends. And I, I like the straight guys who come to our meetings because they're really supportive and they make it really clear that they're secure enough in their sexuality to know that they're not gay, but they're willing to be straight allies. I'm kind of moved by that. And, um, you know, they say gay guys are cool as long as they don't hit on them. And I guess I can respect that, you know. They have their boundaries. They are teenage guys. And besides, as a lot of these guys point out, two chicks getting it on is hot. And I'm just like, okay, you guys, fine. As long as you're tolerant. Well, that's cool that these straight guys aren't afraid to look fruity. And it makes me feel hopeful about this new generation that's coming up. Tell me the truth. Any dormant queers in the group? I, mean, I think there's a few girls in the group who might come out as lesbians next semester, at least I'm hoping. I've been trying to sit each one of them aside and talk to them personally about it and see if maybe I can, well, muscle them into it. So what do you do in these meetings? We did have a social mixer last semester. That was our, our big project that we worked on all school year. And um, a lot of kids came. There was a really good turnout. And I don't think any gay kids came. But a lot of girls were there, and they would kind of dance with each other. And I thought it was really cute. I thought it was really sweet. What's next for the club? So our project for next semester is going to be Project Find the Gays. And pretty much what we're going to do is next semester, we're going to try to get some gay kids to come to our meetings, especially if we offer free corn chips at the meetings. Chips and dip, huh? <laughs> chips and salsa dip really gets kids to show up. What's the big payoff for you? Nothing feels better than just having a group of kids there we're all united under the same cause, our pride. Their pride in the gay people who they support. Maybe they don't know any personally, but at least in the media. And I'm a gay person that they know, and I th I'm very proud to be that person that they can know. So I'm really proud of how far our um, Gay Straight Alliance has really come in the two years that I've been chairperson of the group. Well, Rick, I commend you on your work. Thank you. And thank you for offering us your life's riches. Getting to know you with Damiana Garcia.